It is the calm before the storm. The last couple of days we've been mentioning how we expect a lot of moisture to come up from the Gulf and give us a really good chance of some hefty rainfall to lead to some flooding. And here we go. A slight risk for if not all, at least most of the Q2 viewing area today. Excessive rainfall, slight chance. These areas uh, could get one to two inches of rainfall. Some localized spots, three to five inches of rainfall is possible. That's why we do have that flood watch in effect all the way through late Saturday night, early Sunday morning. Those uh, shaded areas watch out, especially in flood prone areas, uh, areas along the rivers that could see some flooding. Right now, the Yellowstone looks like it's going to be OK. Um, the Bighorn at to Harden looks like by the time we get to Sunday, Sunday night into maybe Monday, Monday night, we could see some moderate flooding around the banks there, especially around Harden. So I just want to give you an update uh, on that where we can see some river, uh, river flooding. Also, we could see uh, water covered roads. So please be careful. Don't drive through that stuff. And those areas who have base basements that are prone to flooding, eh, this is not good news for you either. There is a chance. Also, on top of the heavy rainfall, we could see some severe weather. Marginal slight to enhance risk, especially in the yellow and definitely the brown shaded areas there. What are we looking at? From 1 p.m. until 11 p.m. tonight, moving from south to north, we're looking at the possibility of uh, golf ball size hail, and we could have damaging wind gusts up to 80 miles an hour. Stay safe today, everybody.